Hello, Faith. Lent and Easter are over, but we continue to live our lives as a disciple. For that, Pastor Heather and Mark have prepared something special with youth. So I invite Mark, our uh, youth director, to introduce this. So please tell us about this. Sure. Uh, this Sunday, the 24th, is c uh, Confirmation Sunday for our 8th graders. They've spent September through April uh, in their confirmation process, which means they, I like to call it Christianity 101 type stuff. And they learn about more about God and Jesus and prayers, presence, gifts, service, witness. Um, they take a spiritual gifts test so they can kind of figure out how they're gifted. They talk about the history of the Methodist Church and the history of faith and just a wide range of things to help further them down their path as, as a disciple. So this Sunday at the 11 o'clock service, we'll be confirming them into the United Methodist Church, which means they publicly say that they are followers of Jesus and that profession of faith, and then they take the vows of membership into the United Methodist Church and into faith. Um, it's a really amazing time to watch. Their families are present. Uh, some friends can come up, their mentors, which is um, a person in the congregation that has been walking alongside them through this. They started that process in January, and they have met weekly since the middle of January through last week. So about 13 times they meet together for about an hour each, and they just talk about life in general and what's going on and questions about faith, and they get to really develop a really cool relationship between an eighth grade student mm -hmm. and an adult in the congregation that gets to pour back into them uh, for this time frame. And so that mentor will be there and present them for confirmation and be able to stand with them and their families as they take the vow of membership and join the United Methodist Church, which I think is great because not a lot of churches allow you know 13 year olds to be full members of the church, which means they have voting rights and are able to you know give with their, their money and their time. And if we have a church vote, they get to come participate in that. And I just think that's amazing about the United Methodist Church and how we treat 13-year-olds uh, or when they become members as in uh, eighth grade. It's been a great process. Our kids have learned a lot. They've worked really hard, uh, spent a lot of time with their families and with their mentors. It's gonna be an incredible Sunday uh, morning. So I would uh, you know, recommend that y'all come and watch and just see what it's like for our eighth graders as they join the church on Sunday. Well, wow, wonderful. Yeah, I think it's yeah. gonna be great. Yeah, confirmation is very important to uh, our uh, United Methodist tradition. Mm -hmm. Yes, so, it is. Yeah, it will be great. Yeah, yeah. it'll be really Please good. Please join. And additionally, we have a blessing backpack and a night tursa, night light tursa next week for the mission. We will be filling over two hundred backpack uh, on next Wednesday, April twenty seven at six p.m. And then we will go to the uh, downtown Tulsa. Uh, these backpack will be handed out to our neighbors the next day, April 28th, 6 p.m. And you can sign up for the ride, the van, uh, church van at the church website. Go to Tulsa, uh, go to facetulsa.org and click the Stay Connected button. Please join our mission and let's worship together uh, God uh, this Sunday. Oh, I forgot one thing, yeah. Lastly, we invite our new uh, church member and guest uh, on May 1st yeah. at noon. So we provide lunch and have uh, time to introduce our mm -hmm. church and answer uh, questions from our guests. And then we will offer a tour of the building. So if you'd like to join us, please sign up our uh, church website. Mm -hmm. Click the Stay Connected button, as always we do, and you can find the link. See you on Sunday. See you Sunday. Thank you. Bye.